to you all. We all probably know about Khabib Nurmagomedov, the Dagestani eagle, the giant man, the superstar, the hitter, the most strongest person, the undefeated hero of MMM, the best lightweight fighter ever the world has ever seen. And his name is Khabib Nurmagomedov from Dagestan, Russia. Now I'm here, he's gonna discuss uh, about why the UFC authority or the MMA authority doesn't want to listen the uh, the, the the actually the talking of or the request of Khabib Nurmagomedov. He again and again asked Dana White, the chairman of MMA that he is ready he's completely ready khabib is completely ready to fight his first man conor mcgregor but but dara and his fellows again and again rejected khabib's khabib's request to organize the fight between dara and khabib nurmagomedov and this time dara is um dara and other people they are also uh not actually hearing the speech of Khabib Nurmagomedov. We personally, I, I like him. With the Bangladeshi people, they are not a fan of this type of MMA. But I am a fan of Khabib. I watch his fighting. And love from you, Khabib brother. <laughs> we love Dagestan. We love uh, you very much. And um, so I am here pointing three points. Why UFC doesn't love doesn't like doesn't want to show khabib is becoming the number one uh champion of the world he is challenging again and again that he wants to fight anybody from any weight not only light weight heavy weight or anything weight khabib challenges anybody openly challenges at this type of that uh, dana and Khabib's challenges like this day, uh, yeah, hey Dana, be careful, I'm gonna smash your son, okay? <laughs> so this man, I love him, he is very much honest, he is an honest guy, he believes and he talks what he believes. So, here are three reasons why UFC is not hearing Khabib's voice. Number one, Khabib's is undi- un undefeatable Khabib uh, in MMA history the only player the only contender he is unbeatable undefeatable 25 masses and no loss every mass Khabib smashed and knocked out the opponents and that's what it is Khabib the eagle from Dagestan so this is a reason MMA doesn't want Khabib's to be number one because the MMA or the UFC authority they are capitalist yeah they want uh, they want money money from people and they have their white people their champion uh, like Conor McGregor or Tony Ferguson the bullshit <laughs> according to uh, Khabib these people are white people and uh, they are western people actually i'm not uh, using this white term they're western people and their champion the money still remains in the west all but when khabib becomes champion the money from from western uh, western companies and mma and ufc authorities the money is going to dagestan okay so they don't want want it i i believe it that's my personal uh, research why i i have um discovered three reasons why they don't like khabib Nurmagomedov. number three is that he is undefeatable in 25 masses that's 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 a tremendous achievement and in the history of ufc there is nobody who is undefeatable in continuous 25 masses that's why khabib is one khabib is the greatest one mashallah and the God gives uh, the ability to Khabib and I believe he will be on the the, the strongest man of the world you, by uh, unanimous decision like he unanim like 
with the unanimous decision he defeated 25 opponents and smashed and smashed and I believe Khabib he will, he will do a bit. So that's the reason number three is Khabib is undefeatable and that's why MMA and UFC authority doesn't want to see him more undefeatable. Number two, Khabib is a Russian. The West, the Western uh, world, actually the U, uh, the 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 Western Europe and the North America, actually United States of America and Canada, they don't like, they don't love Russia. And Khabib's from uh, a Russian, a Russian autonomous state named Dagestan. These Dagestani people, they are very much, they are very much daring. They are very much good in uh, uh, come in in mixing with people but it, at the end the west see khabib as a russian there is a war a war uh, a silent cold war between the west and the russia we all know about it so here is here is a matter why the ufc president dana and other folks they don't like uh, khabib nurmagomedov at the end of the day they are a russian to them a russian citizen okay so uh, a russian citizen is gonna be a uh, champion of the world the western world actually the united states of america they don't want to see it i i believe that that's my personal this is number two and number one the number one reason why ufc and mma authorities don't or doesn't love khabib nurmagomedov is khabib's religion khabib is a muslim that's a problem to them that Khabib is a Muslim, but that's not a problem. That can't be a problem. The Western neoliberalist theories theories tell us that a religious views cannot be seen to discriminate others. But Khabib, I think, I believe, and that's the reason that Khabib is um, rejected by Dana White uh, after after giving again and again warning to fight. His son, his so-called son uh, of Mac Colonel McGregor and Tony Ferguson, but they, but they, they, uh, they don't, they didn't actually um, arrange the match between Khabib and and Conor McGregor and the Irish guy and and Tony Ferguson, the American guy, I guess. So because they don't want to see a Muslim guy named Khabib Nurmagomedov, his son's name is Muhammad. He is gonna dominate in their in their um, MMA history. He's undefeated in 25 matches. Khabib Nurmagomedov, and he's gonna smash the the Western people. They don't want it. This is a psychological game, I think. And these people want want to uh, these people like Dana White and others. They don't want to see a Muslim man. A champion of lightweight or heavyweight or anything because Khabib again and again tells that UFC wants money okay then if they want money they they should uh, arrange a match between between Khabib and others but UFC actually doesn't want money in this uh, case because Khabib is gonna win inshallah and Khabib is a man he challenges everybody in the lightweight and heavyweight so why? What is the problem, Dana, to organize a match? Khabib's, Khabib is passing his best times. So now, this time, Khabib is again and again and again requesting you to arrange a match to show his ability to smash your boys like Conor McGregor and Tony Ferguson, the Joker. The, so these people, they can't be, they, they, they will be easily defeated by Khabib. And that's your fear. Khabib Nurmagomedov, a Muslim, is gonna win MMA championship. He will be the most ferocious, most dangerous, the number one champion of lightweight in the history of MMA and authority. You people don't want it. That's so pathetic. Uh, you should look what Khabib is, what his uh, what Khabib is, and what is he doing in in the case. In the fighting field, I I I asked uh, almost the 25 masses of Khabib. He is very much respectful to the opponents. He attacks them ferociously, but he 
attacked and then after finishing the mess he he said that brother it's it's a game please don't uh, upset this is Khabib and he always is a very shy guy you know very honest he doesn't uh, tell a lie a single lie actually so that's why that's the reason I think now is the time to uh, uh, grow up MMA and UFC authority and Dana White grow up man don't 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 be biased uh, on Khabib Nurmagomedov let him let him play let him fight to anybody what he wants to anybody whom he wants to fight give him the chance be wider don't be narrow minded don't judge Khabib by his religion Khabib is a human being he is from Dagestan and he is going to smash every single contender any anything from heavyweight lightweight or featherweight Khabib is going to win inshallah with the people of of the world is with Khabib it's Khabib times okay Khabib we are with you man